Hi, Charlie here. Today we're going to talk about DWI fines. Okay, these used to be called surcharges, but that law changed, and so now pretty much everyone refers to them as these fines. Now they could be three thousand dollars, forty-five hundred dollars, six thousand dollars. These are fines that are imposed if you're convicted of a DWI, meaning straight probation or a jail sentence. Now the judge in your case can waive these fines if they find that you're indigent okay and different judges sort of have different standards on that but we or certainly any decent defense attorney is going to try to convince a judge to waive these fines if you're in that category um, but it is ultimately up to the judge now in travis county they want you after you're sentenced to either straight probation or a jail sentence to go down and sort of set up a payment plan for these fines, okay? And they will come up with a, an appropriate number of months or years for you to pay that fine out. Now, if you don't pay the DWI fine in Travis County, um, basically what happens is they just keep sending you letters saying, hey, you owe us this money, and it just sort of stays there. Now, I have some clients that can't tolerate letters saying, that they owe money to somewhere um, and I have some clients that couldn't care less that they get a letter saying they owe money. I don't know what your particular disposition is but that is basically the, the consequence of not paying this this type of DWI fine. Now we have to distinguish that from probation fees and probation fines and court costs. You really need to pay those because the consequence of not doing that is you can get in trouble with the judge. I'm referring specifically to these legislatively imposed DWI fines of the $3,000, $4,500, or $6,000. All right, I hope that helps you understand.